hello friends how are you all today we are going to discuss a value based question of uh, class 9th and the book is b high and the very first chapter we are going to discuss here and uh, i have taken i have decided a question a value based question for you and that is a burning issue nowadays and since uh, this pandemic has taken place uh, world wide so we can understand the words or the importance of this matter and uh, in the first chapter the fun they had we had seen that uh, there is a comparison between human teacher and mechanical teacher and since covid has broken out so after this outburst we have also seen uh, that uh, how it used to be uh, when we have classes online when a mechanical teacher is there or we are sitting at one place in our uh, home and one after the other teachers are coming or uh, online we are learning everything so uh, i know that this is somewhat different uh, because uh, obviously after covid we have seen all the uh, technicalities in terms of learning so uh, in this chapter also there is a a uh, futuristic way which is shown that what is going to happen in 22nd century uh, and it is a time of 20 uh, 157 i think so uh, a futuristic way is shown here in this chapter when uh, ebooks and uh, telebooks are there and learning is happening through a uh, computer screen or uh, a mechanical teacher is teaching uh, all the subjects okay so uh, here we are going to discuss how human teacher is better than mechanical teacher and i'm sure after this uh, uh, video you are going to understand how human teachers are better than mechanical teachers so we are going to see some key points here for uh, human teachers as well as for mechanical teachers and then you will be the better judge who's the better and we can understand who is better than whom okay so uh, let's start so first of all we are going to see the characteristics or uh, attributes of human teacher okay so they not only provide bookish knowledge but also inspire their students so uh, we can uh, say that all our teachers all our professors have bookish knowledge but also they inspire their students so they can inspire their students now next point is they guide their students how to live a meaningful and successful life and most importantly they guide their students they uh, they are the good mentors for their st uh, students and they tell their students how to live a meaningful and successful life now next is they burn themselves like a candle throughout their lives to remove the darkness and ignorance from their students life and moreover they burn like a candle throughout their career uh, Uh, professional career we can say why they burn themselves like a candle because they want to remove they have to remove the darkness and ignorance from their students life okay then only uh, they will be uh, then only that means when they will have struggles throughout they will be uh, having good experience and they will be uh, i mean to say they will be uh, experienced enough to remove the darkness and ignorance from anybody's or from their students like and last but not the least they know individual intellect of their students and in our uh, school life and in our college life also uh, we have understood that teachers are the better judge and they can understand our individual intellect they can understand uh, what kind of a learner we are and accordingly they used to treat us and they used to give assignments to us okay so uh, for human teacher uh, these points can be uh, learned by you not the if not the whole uh, sentences you can uh, learn the key points that uh, they don't they not only provide bookish knowledge but they provide or uh, sorry they uh, inspire their students okay now so uh, key point can be inspire they can inspire us next is they guide their students how to live a meaningful and successful life next is they uh, remove the darkness and 
ignorance so this can be our key point now next is they no individual intellect of their students now it comes to mechanical teacher okay now so mechanical teacher it can provide ample knowledge on various subjects but it can't boost up their students to do something distinguished okay so uh, agar uh, if we are we are to compare a uh, human teacher with mechanical teacher so uh, this is the first point and uh, we can say it cannot boost up cannot boost up their students to do something distinguished to do something important in their life or specific in their life okay only the only thing they can provide is they have ample knowledge next is there is no uh, companion no playground no fun at all and when mechanical teacher is there and you are on your uh, computer screen you are in one room there is no companion with you no playground with you uh, for you and no fun at all and last but not the least the teaching is mechanical and monotonous and after some time you will uh, see that the uh, mundane kind of thing is taking place every day the same thing is happening no fun at all and moreover it is mechanical that you sit uh, in front of the uh, computer and you learn different subjects okay so Uh, points can be no companion no playground and no fun at all fun why it is missing is it missing because no companion is there and uh, no uh, other students are there to talk to and to play with and that's why it becomes monotonous okay and it is very much mechanical okay so uh, these are the points key points which you can learn for your exam and uh, i hope this video uh, is quite good for you and uh, you can understand the theme of this chapter okay so for these kind of videos subscribe to my channel if you are still new to my channel and if you like this share it with your friends okay keep watching bye bye